In this tutorial, we are going to introduce block with attributes in JSTACAD. An attribute is a label or tag that attaches data to a block. For example, this TV block has a size label on it, and we can associate more than one attribute with a block. Let's insert a block with attributes. You can see JSTACAD promotes us to provide values for each of attributes that are associated with a block. Now, we are going to figure out how to create a block with attributes. Here are some lines and I'm tags in the drawing, so let's convert them to a block with attributes. First, we need to configure attributes before they are associated with a block. Click Define Attribute command in the Ribbon Block Definition panel. The Attribute Definition dialog box pops up. And let's enter a prompt for an attribute which is displayed in the Edit Attributes dialog box or at the command prompt during the insertion of a block to let you know the type of information an attribute expects. Then enter value for the talk option. That will be displayed prior to the attribute being added to a block by identifying the attribute. We can set the height of attribute text by clicking this icon and specifying on the drawing or just enter a number. As for default option, it is used if a variable value is not entered at the promote. OK, place the attribute here, and notice that whatever I entered in the tag blank will be changed to uppercase. Then press enter to repeat the command. Next, we need to convert the objects and attributes to a block. Input block command, press enter, type a name, specify the insertion point, and window select all the objects. Enter. OK. You will notice that the prompts in the edit attribute dialog box are not displayed in the order as I expect. So let's explode the block and create a new one. This time I will select these attributes one by one, and then select other objects. Enter. OK, you can see the prompts are displayed in the order as I select them in the drawing. Let's move up and insert the block. The edit attributes dialog box pops up, so follow the prompts and input the content in the blanks. OK, and if we need to modify the attributes of a block, just double click the block or click the edit attribute command in the ribbon block panel and select the block. The enhanced attribute editor dialog box appears. Then we can modify the value and properties of the attribute text. 